its national side has progressed. And many more, of course. Picked up by Reed to Smith. Here's Cruden. Cruden sees a gap. Couldn't get the offload away, but look at Smith. And Smith's in space. He's got Kieran Reed alongside him. Kieran Reed straight through the gap. The captain gets the opening try. F the ball sloppy on the floor, and just look at the pickup from Smith. There's the break from Cruden. How quickly Smith is onto it. And look at the vision, looking left and right, left and right. The footwork of Reed. He wouldn't be out of place in the centre, that man. Gori the scrum half on to Castro Giovanni. Tackler release. Spreading it wide. There's a Kera. Here's the chance. There's the try. And it's gone to Alberto Scarbi. His first ever test try. Well, great reward. Great reward for the Italians. And listen to the crowd respond. His 22nd test match. And on what a stage and against what opposition to get your first five points. Robert Barbieri, an Italian international with a strong North American accent, made his test debut on the same day as, bro as his brother made his first appearance for Canada. Mike was playing against England in the Churchill Cup. Here's a chance for the All Blacks, the offload to Nono. Nono's through. Ma Nonu, when he's coming through at that sort of speed, is pretty much unstoppable. Well, there we go. New Zealand starting this second half in a different gear. So often the case, competitive at the end of the first. And they come out, and it's been all one-way traffic. The offload from Sevilla into the line off the set piece off straight off the training ground that move the replacement at scrum half Ridley there to Eda Kerbalo oh away goes Kane Kane with the offload to Kerbalo on to Franks Cruden There's a real chance here, and breaking through is Corey Jane. Well, that was very disappointing for Italy. That was just a little too easy. Well, the, the subs for New Zealand having an impact. Kerbalo on. Waikato chief scrum up a real dangerous runner. Getting some tempo in there. Aaron Smith had a good game, but he came off the bench again last week in Scotland had a good impact and then Corey Jane another substitute there evading a couple of tackles the last of which Scarby sprawled out on the deck gear trying to find a way through but the Missouri blue jerseys managing to repel him that's Caballo Corey Jane Nonu it's a two on one Sevilla It wasn't the prettiest try. Venditti had to step in. Botez with the attempt, but really, it's a hiding to nothing trying to stop a winger at full two who's sliding in. Ball in the wrong hand, but nah, no doubt about it. Try time for Sevilla. Yeah, yeah you may award the try. Easy call that one for Nigel Whitehouse. So you're going to have to go from deep now. Cortez. We're looking for encouragement for Italy in the 11 previous test matches involving these sides. The All Blacks scored 92 tries. Corey Jane could be another one. It is. Sevilla. Well, Julian Sevilla picked up two against the Scots last week. And as strong as...
as Italy were in the first 40. If we are going to be very critical, they have rather let themselves down in the last 15 minutes or so. It comes down again, the kicking negative. Botes with just a, a box kick to nothing. There's no chase. One pass infield from Gear. Corey Jane opens up a hole you could have fitted the whole team through. And they get so excited. New Zealand rugby.